Mario Michael seems the same as any other six-year-old, but when he started school, his parents noticed something was wrong. He would always struggle with um, small, um, small things like to button his shirt and um, to basically to open something, or even his confidence also. And he gets very frustrated when he when he can't do a certain thing. Mario suffers from developmental coordination disorder, a neurological condition that affects motor skills and movement. Some affected children battle to write legibly, while others have difficulty doing the simplest tasks. Physiotherapists say DCD is underdiagnosed in South Africa, and many parents are unaware of the symptoms. Well, they may not know the word developmental coordination disorder or DCD but everybody knows somebody who is clumsy uh, which is not a nice word of course but, th but that gives an idea of what it is. Bowen Smits Engelsman is a world leader in DCD research. She is supervising a PhD study into the prevalence of the disorder. She says it's found mostly in children from poorer communities in urban centers. In Cape Town's Bonteville community, around 1 in 10 children suffers from DCD. Free physiotherapy is now being provided at three schools. Experts say DCD can be halted by doing physical activity from an early age, often not a high priority of poorer families. I can imagine that nobody worries about a, a child as, uh, falling over its own legs when you have other topics that are very, very important. Physical activity and therapy is helping children like Mario, who has now regained confidence and performs better at school. Researchers intend lobbying the education department to get more physical education classes included into the curriculum. Lester Kivitt, Cape Town.